Hi, this is Luke from the Information Lab. Today I'm going to show you how to create a red, amber, green analysis in Tableau. I've connected to the World Bank Indicators dataset, which comes with Tableau, and used the Data by Country tab. Before starting this video, I've created five calculated fields which will tell me where the values within a measure fall within a red, amber, or green threshold. If I right click in the first one and edit it, you can see the formula here. So basically all I'm saying is if a value is over, in this case 200, then it's green. If it's greater than or equal to 50, then it's amber. If it's less than 50, then it's red, or else it's null. And you'll need to go into the fields beforehand to see the range of values within that field in order to determine um, whether it's red, amber, or green. I've also created a, a rag status dummy here. And this is just populated with a zero value, and this will be central to getting the shapes for the various different calculated fields out into our columns. I'm going to do the analysis by country. So first of all, I'm going to drag country name out onto rows. Next, I'm going to drag the rag status dummy out to columns five times. And in the all section of the marks card, I'm going to change this to be a shape. And then finally, I'm going to remove the zero lines. Right, so in the first rag status dummy section of our marks card, we're going to drag out the first calculated field, the automated tellers field. And I'm going to drop that onto shape. I've already allocated these shapes to the various values, but you can go in and change them. For this demonstration, I've used the KPI shape palette, but there's nothing to stop you from using any of the other ones or creating some custom ones for yourself. Okay, so that's the first one. Next, I'm gonna go into the second tab of our rag status and drag out listed companies. Again, drop that onto shape. I'll do the same for the others. There are five fields. And by using the rag status dummy, we've been able to get the shapes into columns. And all we need to do now is put it into a dashboard. So I'm going to create a dashboard here. Drag in RAG analysis. I'm going to get rid of keys. Last thing to do is add some headers in. So, unfortunately, by doing it this way, we don't get headers on top of the columns, but we can improvise. So, I'm going to create a text box. I'm going to call this one automated tellers. Change it to eight, center it. Create another one. We'll call this one limited companies. Create another one for railways. Center that two and make it eight. Next one stock traded. And then finally transit air passengers, which we call them air passengers. Okay. 
Now I'm going to bring these together by using a horizontal box. I'm going to drag, drag each of them in. Select the layout container, make it floating, and then to drag it to the top of our columns. And there you have it, RAG analysis in Tableau. Nice and easy. Hope you enjoy it. Thank you.